start. Uh, good morning to all of you. This is what you are seeing is a Agrobacterium tumefaciens. Normally, Agrobacterium is a soil-borne pathogen, so it affects uh, uh, the solanaceous crops also. This is a gulf farming bacteria. So normally, when there is a dust in the soil, and then when the soil comes in contact with these uh, uh, places where we have a cut, so the bacterium goes, and then the gulls are extended. So it doesn't affect by and large, but the gull incidence is very high when it when the gulls becomes more and more, and then the translocation of the water and nutrition will be minimal, and it will have an impact on the uh, yield finally. So. How to manage this is, uh, once we notice this uh, agrobacterium, so we will have to uh, sterile the surface before taking the next crop. Uh, the infection rate will be very high if we don't sterile the surface uh, uh, and uh, the next crop, the young plants may be susceptible, uh, will have a early symptoms and susceptibility uh, will be high. Hence, uh, if you notice this agrobacterium, uh, agrobacterium, uh, in the crop, older, older crop, make sure that you uh, uh, clean the surface, take out the uh, plants and then before uh, planting the uh, new crop, then you have to uh, you use some uh, sterilines like uh, uh, H2O2 or any of the uh, sterilines like uh, uh, sodium hypochloride to sterile the entire floor as well as you, you one has to uh, clean these grow bags using the sterilines. So in that way, we can uh, reduce the incidence of agrobacterium tumefaciens uh, in the in the young crop. Thank you.